welcome back to Boss Business Coaching. I'm Alex Todorovic, the Managing Director. I'm here with Riccardo Montiglioni. Montiglioni. <laughs> that, that's Mount a line. mouthful, come on. All right. Um, and you're part of the Boss team. You're from One More Round, but you're helping uh, me uh, with uh, helping small business owners getting fit and healthy, right? Well, a healthy, healthy body, healthy mind. Absolutely. It all goes in together, doesn't and it? And who's your favourite client? Me. You, <laughs> of course. So, I mean, I'm, I'm a pure example of what you do, which is um, getting people into a healthy mindset, pushing themselves to the next limit. That's what I've done um, training with you. You've been an absolute inspiration. So let's talk a little bit oh. about you. What, who, who are you? Who am I? <laughs> oh, so what are you doing now? So what, yeah, so what are you doing right now? Right now, I'm actually um, doing mobile training. I did have a gym for many years, yes. but uh, I've gone into more personal training and working with the individuals and yeah. small groups. Yeah. And it's uh, one more round uh, boxing and fitness trainer. Yeah. But I'm, I've noticed that working with individuals, I'm able to change lives Absolutely. a lot more, and I, I really get a buzz from that, and I'm really enjoying that. Yeah. And just watching their change in the transformation, their, the transformation yeah. not only physical transformation, but their mindset, their relationships, their work. Because well, look know, how much I complained at the start. Well, yeah, you're a perfect <laughs> example, <laughs> Alex. <You're> I, I, <laughs> I was like, I don't want to do this. This is too hard. And now, I mean, I go all the way through and I enjoy it. If anything, I've got even more energy to give at the end of the hour, right? Well, I had, I, I, you know, like I had at the first, I'm like, damn, you're going into business coach, you're doing this, and okay, I'm going to motivate you. <laughs> Absolutely. But, well, you know, I think it was a transforming into the physical aspect and knowing how much your body was capable of and doing yeah. and where you came from. But And being you, comfortable with being uncomfortable. Being comfortable, getting comfortable. What I taught you to do is getting comfortable being uncomfortable because mm. you will puff and you will bug it. <laughs> <laughs> but what happens with that little bit push, you know, because people can easily stop. And just having that little having extra that push, it helps you realise that you are limitless. Absolutely. Yeah. So let's talk about some of your achievements. I mean, you're not just an average personal trainer. No, I'm a hairdresser too. <laughs> you're a hairdresser. <laughs> <laughs> right. uh, one of a kind. Well, you can do your hair and train you. Well, we well, offer a lot of boss a... business coaching. I mean, it really is limited. Um, Sorry, we're not, we're not limited in our services. No, but that... Um, <laughs> You're so you know, strong. I, I was always on. said that I was the toughest hairdresser in Australia. And when I used to cut my cut the hair, I'd always say, Would you, "Do you like your haircut?" They're like, "Yes." This is after I gave them, you know, half an hour spill on my boxing achievements. But uh, so yeah, everyone loved the haircut. Let's, let's talk about your boxing achievements. I mean, you, you know, you are you do there is success to your you know your story. You're not just an average personal trainer. Well, I have got a, a an amateur and professional career in boxing. I mean, I played football, did a little athletics. I've had an active life. From let's say eight years of age, yeah. I was I had so much energy and I kept going. But my moral to everyone is you got to keep moving. Yeah. But with me, I, I had so much energy that um, I I, I did all my physical doing. activity. But then I discovered boxing at twelve because um, I liked the size of the trophies the kids were getting, <laughs> and um, and realised I'd do it. And being a little um, Italian boy, um, copying a lot of. You know, I got bullied quite a lot back down there, and so I thought I'd take up boxing um, to harden myself was, up. Yeah. And Protect chipped yourself. away, just yeah. like everyone else. And then it just was was one day someone said to me, listen, if you want to get in the ring, you have to start doing your own work, homework, which is running every morning and doing all the rest. So I got this instilled in me at an early age. This was during, what, To go 15, that extra mile? To do your homework, which is do that little bit more at home. And plus, my mum being Italian was a great cook and I love to eat a lot. So I had to train harder than everyone else. But... Um, you know, I got her no matter what to wake me up early in the morning. But what I discovered was, you know, fitness was, it just transformed my life at such an early age was I was able to stand out because I wasn't very good. Um, academically? At, academically yeah. because of my language barrier. Yeah, yeah, okay. Because I, I was, grew up in an Italian house. So I thought the only way to dominate is through sport yeah. and, uh, and get acceptance. But um, what I did do is I never gave myself credit for being actually as good as what I was. Yeah. And I try to... Well, I think a lot of people do that. I think, you know, uh, we well, all do that. Well, I think that's did. what keeps us going and, and I compensated, taking us level. I compensated that with training harder and working harder. And I thought no one's going to be able to beat me if... I'm fitter than them. So I felt most people got worn out from hitting me and I beat a lot of better fighters than me 
because I got tired and then <laughs> I dominated. So it was great. So again, this is related to business as well, is that if you keep Absolutely. persisting and keep working harder than everyone else, you're going to dominate the Absolutely. market, dominate whatever you're doing. Absolutely. So and that's what I'm doing at the moment. I mean, that's what you've done for me, 100%. And um, so let's talk about what, what titles have you won? What, let's, let's well, talk about that. Well, I was that. national amateur champ. I represented Australia in London and Los Angeles. That was probably one of my highlights. And also some memories came up on Facebook. One of the guys from 1986 posted up the team photo. And I'm like, damn. And my son's <laughs> like, how old were you? I look like you. We look the same. And it's so true. It was great that that photo came up. And it was such a proud moment. I actually cried during the national anthem. This is just before getting in the ring to fight. Because it was that emotional. It was fantastic to be at that level and I've never really given myself credit for that either but well, then nice I turned professional um, four days before I turned 20 I jumped straight into state titles I got pushed really quickly and then and and lost a few but then I got back up and it wasn't until at 45 when I made a comeback that I won the state cruiserweight title so there awesome. you go anything's possible age is a number and it just depends on how bad you want something absolutely so I'm so excited to have you part of the boss business coaching team so we're going to be um, launching in May, early May, um, these I'm monthly subscriptions, it, yeah. right? So we're, what are we going to be bringing to, to these subscriptions? We're, we're offering, obviously, um, programs for people to get fit and healthy for bosses 100%. and also managers. So let's talk about some of the things that people can expect. You know, for $49 a month, they're going to get access to nutrition plans, fitness programs and business templates. So tell me now, um, you know, what kind of things can we, can our, you know, customers expect? Well, the, putting a lot of thought into it and what I found was something that people can do in their own office, in their own lounge room while they're watching TV, while they're getting kids ready, while they're doing anything in a park, um, waiting for someone traveling, anything like that is Tabata. Tabata is a high intense interval training and um, it doesn't, it, it, it can be done at your own pace as well if you're not fit. Yeah. So you can build up because exercise is measurable, yeah. but a minimum of four minutes a day. Now everyone's got to have four minutes Absolutely. a day, right? Absolutely. Four Absolutely. minutes is nothing to get your metabolism cranking, to start getting fitter, start seeing results quite quickly within and so what's three the, what's, weeks. Well, we always joke about this, can you give me 20 seconds, right? Can you give me 20? <laughs> well, anyone can go 100% for 20 seconds. Absolutely. So you go 20 seconds, it's times eight, it's 20 seconds on, 10 second rest. Yes. 20 seconds on, 10 second rest. You can split that into so many different ways, which we'll look into, it's eight different exercises. It can be either one exercise times eight, it can be two exercises, alternated eight. It can be so anything really working custom. to eight. It's custom made, you build it, do whatever you want. If you want to work on your butt, you want to work on your legs, you want to work on your guns, yeah. then that's what you pump for those yeah. four minutes. And some, what are some of the uh, psychological benefits? I mean, it's it's great for stress relief, right? So oh, as we know, all bosses yeah. are stressed out. We have never have enough time in the day to do what we need to do. So this is an amazing stress relief, Well, it right? is, because I mean, it takes your mind off everything else because you're just trying to breathe. <laughs> <laughs> You're in pain, you're like, I'm going to live. Like, everyone's greatest fear is their last breath. So yeah. when you're breathing, you're gasping for bear. You're not going to be thinking about that. Yeah, exactly. You're going to cut. And look, it, it does revitalize you, no matter what. I mean, you, you actually, look, I finish each session revitalized. So like I said, you can work for as long or as short as you want, but at least four minutes. At but least. You can, but you can go up to... You can do 20 minutes, you can do 30 minutes. I always say four four sets or you know at least yep. 16 minutes a day yep. to get optimum results 16 yep. but you can do more and you can do it at whatever intensity and high level you can do it this is great for beginners from the beginner right through to the um, advanced athlete so um, so it's well, we're going to wrap up here so th you know I'd like to thank you for making the time to meet me today and you're going to hear a lot, a lot more, more. we're yeah, going to be hearing a lot more but uh, we look forward to taking you all on a fitness journey and, um, and your business journey and also nutrition journey. So Actually, to be spot on there, I want you to come on my journey with me as well because I'm commencing this journey again yep. all over. As you know, life happens. Yes. And uh, taking this one here to another level as well, Absolutely. as well as watching your journey. Thanks. So we're back here for Boss Business Coaching and I'm here with one more round coach. Riccardo Montalioni. That's I bet it bet it. I'm still <laughs> <laughs> well, you know, well, well my maiden name was Milovoyevich, so I feel your pain. No. I, it's hard. Well mountain. Good old line. bog it's names. Monty, it's mountain, Leone is lion, so mountain lion, Monty, Leone, break it down to two. You got it. Right. Rock okay. and Ricardo. Rock and Ricardo is your boxing that's it. name. That's my fight name. So we'll, fight name. we'll go with Rock and Ricardo. Right, so we're gonna talk a little bit more about um, how Tabata and boss business coaching are going to come together but 
tell me a little bit more about why you chose Tabata and why you incorporated it into your to your business and into your personal training program. So how did you find it? By accident? <laughs> no. Nah. I'm always, uh, as my gym's one more round, I'm always looking for things that we can do one more round in, one more round, one more round. So you're always looking for the next things. big There's thing. Always, yeah. always something. And I'm always searching for new workouts that I can do with my clients. Now, with training fighters earlier on initially, it um, I needed something that was interval. And dynamic, Because right? with, with, with boxing, it's high intensity, flat out sprinting, amateur boxing. The pros, they ease off a bit more. But the high intensity was, you know, and a lot of people haven't got a lot of time to train. So we need to cram in a lot of a lot, a lot of work of in, a little, in a little time and get the best results. And also, I was looking for something that was going to give them the cardiovascular fitness, but also muscle. Mm, definition yeah. of muscle strength. Because yep. with Tabata, you don't lose muscle. You know, you yep. get gain cardio and you gain strength from yep. muscle. Yep. So, with so it's like the slow, whole package. Well, with <laughs> slow cardio, you actually lose muscle. You gain, right. lose fat, you lose muscle too. Gotcha. You get your leaner, but you don't actually gain muscle. Yeah. Okay. So with Tabata, you actually gain it. And I needed explosiveness and I needed power and yeah. I needed strength and I needed lungs yep. to get through the boxing. So I, what I did was, um, by searching the internet and always looking for stuff, I found this Tabata and I saw it and I thought, all right, and I'm up for a challenge because I was So you found it in your bedroom? <laughs> yeah, it was in my bedroom. So what I did was I wrote it all down and I did a graph on, so I can keep count of everything. I ran up to my gym, which was in a garage because I started in my garage. And then um, I did the workout and it, it, it just really belted me. But it was 16 minutes in total, so it was four minute yeah. rounds. But what I did was I did each exercise for eight rounds. Yep. And, um, you know, I went from 19 chin-ups to 15 chin-ups to 13 down to the last one. I was just hanging there. I couldn't yeah. even pull myself up yeah. and build to that lactic acid. But the results were phenomenal. And I would never let my clients do anything that I haven't done myself. Yeah. Any exercise I see, I would And there's all myself. different types of levels of, of exercise. You've got beginner's exercises, which anybody can do. And then obviously there's more complex there's and more, more harder and advanced, advanced, which obviously you're not going to start off with, right? And there's so, weighted ones. You know, yeah. you can add weights. You can, yeah. you can do stuff. There's right. so much variation. But... I mean, there's something for everyone, right? 100%. So you've got clients of all ages, right? Yep. And all sizes. And all sizes. Right? So yeah. who's who? What's your old? How old is your oldest client? My oldest one was um, 68, and she got told by her surgeon, <laughs> who replaced both her hips, because normally it takes forever to. And she was playing tennis and that, and she credited me, bless her, credited me for her conditioning. Yes. And he said, look, whatever you've been doing. I can do both hips, and she was up and running. Now she's jumping stairs, playing tennis, and doing everything. So, so, I just got the phone call so the age, is, right no limit, right? so age is no limit, right? So age is no limit. Fitness is no limit. You, you, you basically are your own trainer in a sense. You, yep. you, you go as hard as you can go. So there's no pressure. So there's no. I mean, there's no pressure, right? No. So like when we're not. The, the difference between the programs that we run and what's out there on the internet is so many of them are fixed. So many of them are, there's, you've got to do this at this time, at this, you know, this yeah. way. Whereas, you know, what, what we want to bring to people is a way of them being the boss of their own training, right? Their own so day. Their, yeah. their, own, their own game, right? So this is about empowering people to make choices by giving them the guidelines and, and the sort of the rules to how they can get fit. But then they make up what suits them and what they feel they can achieve, right? 100%. Like even as far as um, a, a new mother... Um, a, a, a boss, an executive, a student. It could be absolutely anyone. Yep. All you need to start with is four minutes. So what's your philosophy? We've got 40, uh, 48. I was saying there's, there's 48, 30 minutes in a day. That's if you want the full workout. But then there's 96, yep. 15 minutes. Yep. Now, that's if you want to warm up, cool down, have yep. a shower and do a four-minute workout. Yep. So you really... There's no excuses. To right? finding a slot There's to do no this, excuses. right? excuses. The only limits you have are the limits you place on yourself. Absolutely. Right? unlimited. So you can do four minutes, smash it, get your metabolism cranking. Yep. You're going to burn fat and get fitter in four minutes, yep. right? Yeah. So four minutes. Then from there, you can do a double if you want. But with that four minutes, you can do eight different exercises. You can pick two exercises or four exercises, do them twice, or two exercises, do them four times, or one yep. exercise, do it eight times, and yep. you're going to get results. So what kind of um, what kind of exercise we, we've spoken about about we can do squats push-ups yep crunches uh, um you know dips the, yeah. dips on your lounge on your now lounge, well, we do we do this all the time at Cottesloe, right so we we do dips all the time it's it's 
it's given well, me strong arms. It's on the way here. They're like, if you're watching TV, let's say normal TV, not that many people watch it anymore. Yeah. Because the commercial breaks, <laughs> you're like, whoop. But if you don't like commercial breaks, you don't have to reach for that remote anymore. You're about three minutes of commercial break, right? Yeah. So it only takes four minutes, so you might slip in for a minute. But <laughs> you can just get your timer on and start doing dips yeah. on your lounge. Yeah. Like, or you some can crunches. Get down and do some yeah. crunches. You can get down and do push ups. Get eight out the way. You've done your workout and carry on watching movies. Yeah. And if you want, every commercial, smash out four minute workout. You've done your 16 minute workout. Perfect, Boom. right. But so you. It, it basically, this, without a doubt, this routine, this program fits in with every everyone's lifestyle. It's because no how excuse. busy are we? Are we but we are We're all busy. busy. We're busy. all busy, right? But yeah. this is a this fits in yeah. and it achieves results. I think it's, it takes longer to go through a drive through fast food food <laughs> outlet than it does for a four-minute workout yeah. in your lounge, in your office, in your hotel room, wherever you're travelling, on a park bench while you're waiting for yeah. someone. Just smash it. It's so we're also going to be having uh, videos on the website, which is a part of the subscriptions model. So yeah, forty. So you know, we'll we'll be filming down at Cotter. So we'll all be, also be filming in my office. So just to show people the different variations, right? Yeah, where you can do it, and how you can do it. We'll do it anyway. And we'll also incorporate boxing into that as well. So yeah, it's going it's, to be let's, fun. You know, that's the fun stuff. So yeah. um, and you know, we're going to pair it up so you can actually do it on your own. Or if you've got a partner, so again, we're we're giving people many options, yeah, many different ways. We're going to incorporate boxing with the body weight exercises as well, so you can mix it up yourself. Because um, everyone, like, if you do have a high stress job, it's always good to hit something. Absolutely, <laughs> I have done that a few or times. Someone, yeah, she misses the pad sometimes. <laughs> like, Hello. <laughs> But uh, okay, so look, you know, we're, we're so excited about this, really. We are. We've been talking about this. We, a lot of planning has been put into this. This is something that we're really both passionate about. Yeah. And, you know, coming from a business perspective, I've seen the absolute benefits of what you do and how you do it. So we're both really looking forward to it, right? It's awesome. And the, and the changes have been quite dramatic, but also so quickly. So, so uh, unbelievably quick. The results, because you, you actually get fitter nine times, nine up to nine times faster. But even your mindset. Everything's fantastic. Yeah. You start realising you're capable of so much more. And you have those breakthrough moments yeah. and then you just take that through to your everyday life, not yeah. just in, in business, but in your personal life yeah. as well. So look, we'll, uh, we'll be keeping you in touch and bringing more videos and talking about more exciting more things. And um, we can't wait for you to subscribe to our monthly program, which we're really looking forward to. What I've seen is a life, life change, the biggest benefit that I've seen from people with fitness and health, a healthy, uh, just being healthy all around. And by doing the fitness is it transforms, even if they just start with their fitness, the people, the amount of people that I've seen give up on smoking, cut down on drinking, spend more time with family, running around with the kids, um, being promoted at work, um, look, the list goes on. The, because the self-belief in yourself, you become a machine. Right, and that's just through being just even gently fit. If there's such a word as gently fit, just start walking. But just that moving, you just got to keep moving. But if you start getting fitter, you start kicking goals. Like you know, the world's your oyster. It really is. It's just self belief and self. Hi, so welcome back to Boss Business Coaching. I'm Alex Todorovic, and I'm here with Annette Boulder. And you are part of the Boss Team. You're our nutritionist. Yeah. yeah. So I'm the nutritionist on board. Yeah. A, yeah. So, so how, sorry, tell me how you came into being a nutritionist. You, I mean, it's something you sort of didn't really choose, but you've always lived that way, right? You've always wanted to eat healthy and you grew up in a very healthy family, didn't you? Yeah, so I sort of fell into nutrition. I yeah. started on a different life path, but then I've always loved nutrition. It's always been a big core value of mine. Yes. Um, so after a little bit, it sort of made sense to go down that path. And I've absolutely, so I've been studying it now for five years and I've loved it. Yeah. Um, so you bring a lot of experience and yeah. a lot of knowledge. And, you, you know, you really enjoy sharing this with others now because, I mean, this is something that you eat, breathe and sleep. Um, yeah. and, and a big believer in so it's really um, it's really a passion of yours now to share that with others right to get them educated yeah right? yeah so I think there's a lot of misinformation out there Absolutely. these days um, comes from a lot of things definitely social media blowing up has also given a lot of people have a lot of misinformation the ability yeah. to, be able to spread it really yeah. quickly yeah um, so I think just I wanted to get out there and teach everyone that coming back to the basics can be really fun, but it's also super beneficial and it's got Absolutely. all the research behind it. Yeah. 
and it's um, it's a lot more sustainable as well in that's, a lot of ways. And that's what we're about as well. It's creating sustainable nutrition, sustainable eating, and sustainable programs, dietary programs that people can fit into their busy lifestyles. Right? We're not here to make it complicated, yeah. are we? No, no. So we don't want to create some crazy thing where you have to wake up at three a.m. and yeah. take some supplement. That's yeah. ridiculous. People can't do it. And not eat like yeah, and not eat six months. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You know? so, so we're just about variety and you know yeah. making it sustainable making it fit into your lifestyle not making your lifestyle have to revolve around the diet yeah. so talk, let, getting back to nutrition there's so much misconception out there so talk about some of the three challenges that you experience with clients yeah um so there's lots of challenges that people experience but probably the three most common that we come across would definitely be the first and foremost would be cost you know yeah. some of the diets out there and fads um they call for really expensive, unnecessary ingredients. Yes. Um, that have a lot of hype around them that isn't probably as necessary as it needs to be. Yeah. Um, you've also got um, time as well. People are trying to make diets, that trying to make their life adjust to fit around a diet when yeah. it should be the other way. Around. It needs to fit your life the diet needs to fit into your life. Absolutely, because some of these some of these programs out there are ridiculously complex. Yeah. And <laughs> you know you, you'd be spending three days in the kitchen prepping for the following week, which time cost but also what's the biggest trap that people fall into when they're on a program so i think the biggest trap is really just coming down to preparation so yeah. so many people in today's society are really busy yeah and they just need to have we're always on the road on the go and the biggest trap is that when we're on the road we, we're picking, bad choices, we're picking right? bag choices we're picking the easiest most convenient choice so it's always good to have those easy go-to snacks that you've yeah. already got prepped or even ones that you can just you know pieces of fruit things like yeah. that that you can yeah. already have really easily prepped yeah. and you can just quickly have them on the go. So it yeah. all comes back to preparation and being prepared and but starting to But also not putting learn. a lot of time into that prep as well. So we're, again, yeah. making it easy. It's not five hours of cooking. It's, it's easy. No. To, so we're using, uh, we're not using expensive ingredients. We're not using unnecessary um, supplements or vitamins. Yeah. And we're not making it hard for you. So really, again, it's about sustainable nutrition and sustainable eating, right? Yeah. And by making it more sustainable, that means you're going to get the longevity out of it as well. Absolutely. It's not a six-week yeah. program. This is a lifestyle choice. This is about being eating well to give you energy, to do well in business, to yeah. uh, manage your staff and to have the energy to do all the chores and duties you need yeah. to do as not only a business owner, but as you know, a family to, member yeah. and life in general. Um, so, you know, this isn't a six week program. This is an ongoing um, program to enhance your life, to improve your life. So we've got two options. Um, so part of the monthly subscription is obviously people get access to fitness videos and also nutrition plan. We also give them education regarding um, some ingredients. Yeah. We've got a cookbook as well. So we yeah. show people how to, to actually cook the food um, and, and what ingredients are included. And then the, the third thing is we also have tailored plan so you can actually come into boss um, headquarters in Claremont sit down with yourself and assess on a one-on-one on -one basis what it is they need so tell me a little bit more about yeah. that so often even though our plans are designed to sort of fit into everyone's life we can also offer that you come in and you sit down with me and I can go through um, definitely things that suit more into your lifestyle we can make it even more individual for you yeah and, and to fit your health as well yeah. and also we, yeah. we don't do just do programs for individuals we do programs for families right so yeah, it's yeah. about um, including everyone in this journey so we you know this isn't about diet this is about healthy eating right we're yeah. not about diet this no. is about healthy eating and that's that's really what we're about but also we want to include the rest of the family so we do do um, family programs yeah so we do do family programs definitely so everything is made so then um, it doesn't matter how many people you live with if your friends want to get involved things like that you can always cook for yeah, them as well yeah it can well. be roommates as well yeah yeah, or, yeah. yeah. Um, so friends and family are always welcome to join in and yeah. all the meals are made for that opportunity yep yeah. so moving forward we're also going to be doing some cooking Show. So we're going to show people how to cook some of these programs, which yep. will be really fun. Um, and we're just going to show you how easy it is to do our programs. Yeah, which so, is super easy because so, it is made to last a long time. We want to see those long-term health benefits, not absolutely. those two-week health this benefits. Is a, these are, this is life-changing, not a six-week, don't eat sugar, don't eat wheat, don't eat bread, don't eat 
anything yeah. program. It's not this restrictive. Is eat, eat, eat food. Yeah. Um, eat, but just eat the right food and at the right time, right? Yeah. It's you coming know. back to learning to love food as well. Absolutely. Really learning where your food comes from and the sustainability behind. And also, it's about also very importantly, just wrapping it up, is just educating people on food. Yeah. I mean, yeah. and giving people some real uh, food truths. We call it. So we're trying to ensure that they're getting quality information about it. So there's so much, like you said, information out there, but we're really about, you know, holistic holistic learning and just ensuring that people can empower themselves to make the right decisions. Yeah, and we just want to spread research, well, the truth that has good research behind it, nothing that doesn't yet have good research and yeah. it's sort of just a craze. Or just to make money. Yeah, <laughs> not that. <laughs> so tell me, what is your passion for nutrition? Where did it come from? Um, so originally growing up, I did grow up a lot in the fashion industry. Yes. Um, so working overseas, and I quickly noticed that you know a lot of the people in our society look up to the people in the magazines and things, and they want to look like them. Yeah. And I quickly realised that the people who were in the magazines didn't have a sustainable diet at all, and it wasn't a good way to go about things. Right. And um, so that was probably my first time because I'd grown up in a family who was always very healthy and yeah. um, always ate very well. So that was when I first became sort of saw the bad effects of eating unhealthy. Yeah. And I quickly realised that a lot of these models aged really badly as well. Yeah. And they often had really moody, didn't really make it throughout the day. Eating. Yeah, <laughs> weren't eating. But also when they did I, eat. I forget <laughs> when I don't yeah. eat. Don't see me when I haven't eaten. It's not a good look. Yeah. Um, when they yeah, did so eat, it was so just bad. So you wanted bad. to bring, uh, you know, so you, you started to see that all these people that people looked up as role models, there was not really much to look up to, right? Yeah, not at all. It was quite misleading, really, if you like. Yeah. yeah. Um, so what I like to do is just make sure that people are getting the right nutrients that they need by eating a wholesome diet that encompasses all parts of a um, natural diet. Yeah. But also it just helps to see, you see, in my clients, I see a lot of a big mood change, a lot more energy as well. And also just the skin and things like that that really start to clear up so and look, look better. They look, they look healthy, better. Yeah. They feel good. So yeah. again, it's about giving people not only energy, but they're feeling good, right? Yeah, exactly. And that's what you want out of a diet because it's yeah. meant to fuel your, fuel your body. It's not meant to slow you down and take away. Yeah. 